are multicellular organisms welcome back to our botany class today in our class we are going to discuss about chloroplast we knew chloroplast is also known as the kitchen of this cell so here chloros in the sense green color plastos nothing but molded so hence the name chloroplast so chloroplast contains generally special pigment that is called chlorophyll so due to this chlorophyll chloroplast is in green color and in this chlorophyll metal is present and element is present that is mg 2 plus so here chloroplast is basically a cell organelle and the two a type of plastid generally plastids are three types these are found in only plant cells nothing but the organisms which are related to kingdom plantae so here plastids are maybe chromoplasts leucoplasts chloroplast chromoplasts are responsible for coloring of flowers petals and corolla and sepals and calyx also and fruits and entire plant body the leucoplasts are colorless they are white in color they are found in mostly in the form of edible parts like vegetables fruits very rare stem and root etc then this is a chloroplast which participate in the trapping the sunlight to perform photosynthesis in this photosynthesis after several chemical reactions glucose molecule is produced this excess of glucose is stored in the form of starch a type of carbohydrate so starch is a reserved food in the plant body coming to the animals body especially humans we are unable to perform photosynthesis and unable to prepare the own food in our own body even we have animal starch in our human body that is called glycogen this glycogen is the reserved food material which is known as animal starch okay so here we are going to discuss about the structure of the chloroplast so here generally chloroplast is present especially in the plants inside the leaves in the mesophyll tissue so what is mesophyll tissue in the sense the combination of pellicid and spongy parenchyma together called mesophyll tissue so this mesophyll tissue uh, structure and location and etc we will be discussed in one more video uh, whenever we will be discussed ts of leaf okay so in the mesophyll especially in a pellicid tissue chloroplast number is more than the spongy tissue chloroplast is discoid shape or round shape or oval shape or star shape also ribbon shape different types of shape it possess so chloroplast is made by specially first membrane is outer membrane then second membrane that is known as inner membrane so two membranes then coming to third membrane this third membrane is modified into special discs so each and every disc is known as thylakoid membrane so here these discs are thylakoid membranes they are arranged in a row so each and every row of these discs is known as granum so such type of granum or rows are located inside the chloroplast around 200 so these 200 around groups of granum called grana grana is plural granum is singular in each granum around 
9 to 12 discs are located. So here these all grana they are interconnected with the help of special channels or the tubes these are known as thylakoid channels or fret channels. So generally these all are floating inside the chloroplast or suspended in inside the chloroplast in a uh, jelly like uh, substance or that matrix is known as a stroma. So inside the stroma dark reaction takes place and the special enzyme that is called RUBP is present ribulose bisphosphate or it is also called rubisco. So dark reaction is the second phase of the photosynthesis. Then the first phase of the photosynthesis is light reaction or light phase. The light reaction takes place on the grana or granum because on the grana or granum PSU are located nothing but photosynthetic units or light harvesting complex. So around 250 to 400 chlorophyll molecules together form an unit that unit is responsible for trapping the photons from the sunlight or harvesting the photons then they will be started the light reaction because granum are responsible for starting the photosynthesis. So phase 1 is light reaction, phase 2 is a dark reaction. So after these two phases finally glucose is synthesized that is synthesized glucose is stored in the form of starch and ATP is and different types of enzymes and chemicals are available in the stroma to perform photosynthesis. Generally all plants they contains chloroplast but some type of leaves and plants they may get different colors than the green color. Then what is the reason? Is that reason chloroplasts are absent in such type of plant leaves? No, chloroplasts are present but remaining plastids, chromoplasts, their percentage and presence, their occurrence dominate the chloroplast because the color differentiation we may get in such type of plants. But chloroplast is compulsory will be presented to perform photosynthesis. So dear multicellular organisms this is the information regarding chloroplast or kitchen of the cell. In one more video we will meet with one more beautiful topic. Thank you. Good luck.